Uh, I'll take out any seeds and, a, and outfits like that. The fire bow, I think I'm just going to dismantle, considering how I have the fire crossbow. Let's sort these guys out. stuff in here for now, any valuables. And I'll put the arrows that I found away. And then I'll also put the seeds. Tomato seeds as well. And actually, I'll go and sell those right now. What the hell just happened to that? Oh, it just... Okay. For a second, I thought it broke while I was... Well, I had it. Alright, uh... Uh, can I just... I can't shoot it. They... Oh, wait, huh? Wait. So why wouldn't it let me shoot on the ground here? It's interesting. Okay, um... Oh, no. I fell into an even worse spot. Ah... I shot and then it immediately fucking reset, which means I might be stuck. Yeah, I'm stuck. Ah. Wait, seriously? Wait, what's... I don't know. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm gonna fucking scream. There's no way around it, like, it's, it's just fucking garbage. I have the ingots, I have the palladium. I need cement for the hypersphere, but why though? It doesn't make any sense. So what's the max I can make? 28? That's only because of the stone level. So what we'll actually do is we'll just make 10. That seems reasonable. Is 
Seriously? Seriously? So close. Wait, what? Wait, what? Huh? Hello? Wait, I'm I'm like literally on top of it, and it's not giving me the prompt. Ooh, what? Are, are you, are you fucking kidding me? Like, I'm about to slam my desk. There we go. Like, are you fucking kidding me right now? You can't make this shit up. You can't. You're even sleeping in a bed? Wow. But now we see the lamps that we got. They are bright. Oh, I guess the air cannon's kind of a shitty skill, then. You already know it, you already know it. Let's see if it's better for Bushi. It's literally the same power. Crazy. Uh, let's go more fire-centric. I'll leave the grass attacks, too. So I have grass, I have fire, I have water, I have another fire that's also a bit of dark, but it actually doesn't have any dark attacks, which is strange. But then Lunaris, who actually has dark and electricity. Alright, I basically have like an all-around team right now. And here's what we'll do. That's how we'll get her to pump out those, uh, you know, those, uh, spheres. Oh, I just crawl through my base. Does that make sense?
Alright, I think... I think one thing... Sorry, I just was having a mini seizure. Just about like... I don't understand why the stick drift happens so much. Especially when I go into a freaking chest or whatever. It pisses me off so much. Okay, but... I think one thing that I have to come to terms with is... I don't think I need a woolly pop. I have about 300 cotton candy. And I only really use it for the sanity to get up after uh, one of my dudes gets beat. Because the people... Because the sanity of the pals in here I don't care about because I have a hot spring. Or not a hot spring, I have a hot tub. I need the hot spring for the next quest. So... I think one thing that I want to do is... I want to get like a miner that's also like a transporter. But then again, that might be asking for too much. A miner that's also a transporter. Oh, another Tombat? I guess we can get another Tombat. get the level 11 Tomba instead. Yeah. Oh, that was Lunaris. I'm an idiot. But she's probably done with this task anyway, so it's fine. Yep, got my Gigaspheres. Lunaris, what are you doing? I assigned you to there, so, uh, stay there. Once I mine this guy, I can start up the uh, furnaces again, get another rotation of ingots going. 78, I like that number. Yeah, I got 358. Cotton candy. I think I'll be fine. Uh... I guess what we can do while we're waiting for the electric is we can go sell our valuables at the small settlement real quick. Oh, this guy spawned? I'll take care of this guy first. Alright, let's, uh, you seem very comfortable, 
22 minutes. Okay. Let's go to the small settlement and see what they have to offer. Gobfin would be the only thing I'd be interesting interested in considering I don't have it. Yeah, and at some point I'm just gonna have to look through all my pals and see what they give me and if they're worth uh, butchering. That'll take a long ass time though. Thirty thousand. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I think it's time for another boss fight. The only downside is let's just double check. I am technically not a high enough level to fight any of them, so I'm not too sure how the power scaling is going to be. Okay, but that's fine, because what I'll do is I'll just... I'll just do the most stressful thing in this game sort through all my pals and see what is worth to butcher. I'm probably gonna try and butcher like all all the ones that I don't need. Alright, let's put Oh, oh you're on a short break. I'm sorry. You, you can go chill in here for a short break if you want. I think it's in here, but it's... What do I get at the next level? A fine bed. Improved restorative abilities. Well, once I get that, don't mind if I do. And then also the pickaxe, yep. Metal structure set. Tomato plantation. Well, I wonder what they'll give me, you know. Uh, I think for right now, do I want to get a handgun or a production line? Produces items faster. I don't really need the production line if that's what it's giving me. A single shot sphere launcher. Interesting. Can capture distant pals. Oh, I need refined and polymer and carbon. What the fuck? hell with that. Should I just get the large feedback? Probably. I can't make it though. But it's better than the distant thing. Uh, I could make the handgun. The only thing that sucks is I don't have, I don't have the ability to make the handgun ammo. So why don't I do... Alright, I'll just have the makeshift handgun, but I don't think I'm going to build it. Oh, it doesn't tell me how much damage. Chat! Wanted, I, that, that's the whole reason why I bought it. Because I wanted to see if it would tell me how much damage it will have. Alright, so let's deal with the lamb balls, chickpeas, and ceramus. Let's scroll all the way up. Lamb balls. Drop lamb ball mutton, which is good, and wool. Chickpea poultry, which is good. Egg, which is good. And then what was the next thing? 
Ceramus, which is full. That's good. So, what I'll do is I will place all my pals that I rock on this page. And then. It's a shame there's no, like, quick move. Level 19 Lambo. Oh, yeah. Sorry, bud. This is all it's gonna be for the next like 15 to 20 minutes. Just gonna be me straight butchering all of these. question is, do I want to keep one of each? I probably should have kept my level 19, to be honest, but this guy's got really good skills, so I'll just keep him. And then Sirius, work speed goes up. Work speed goes up by 50%. Jesus. Alright. So, I'll just continue to butcher. Why is it saying pet? Like, it's glitching out and having the sphere in my hand. is nice so I'll keep that one uh, let's real quick sort with the alpha pal oh alpha pal is in like the rare and boss types uh -huh. and then it does do the pal deck type stuff Uh, 
Honestly, the honey. I'm just gonna eat. So wait, which one do I, would would I want to keep? Muscle head. I'll keep the muscle head one because if I ever do want to run Leaf Monk for some reason, I have the yeah. submachine gun. So like. such a weird thing. Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck? What the hell just happened? I almost died. What happened there? It's like I got slingshotted. Always keep the artisan. Oh. Now, wasn't Fox Parks one of those ones that <laughs> I did want to kill? Could they give me leather? Ooh. Nice. Still got a quite a ways to go. Yeah. I might save butchering the rest after that uh, egg hatches. before I kill you. Oh yeah, I also discovered that... I discovered it earlier, but I didn't say anything. If you hold B, you'll actually crouch. I, th I thought it was strange that you could 
that I got into crouching. Like, uh, like I got crouching without actually like trying. All right, let's see. Leather, electric organ, mushroom. So is there anyone that I would want to keep? I suppose I'll keep the motivation one. I mean, burly body is good, but this guy's got both motivational leader and runner. Just to give you guys a kind of like a little knowledge about uh, this stream, um, it is approximately around 9 o'clock at night, and if I get a Grizzbolt, I'm going to scream at the top of my fucking lungs, break every window in my house. If I get a Grizzbolt, it's over. did that get up there? Alright, swift and serious. Okay, let's get rid of the hooligan. Let's get rid of the hydromaniac. Let's get rid of the pyromaniac. Oh no, I'm petting him before I kill him. Workaholic is the sand depletion, which I don't really care about. Player speed. And then this one's move. And eh, the work speed I'd rather have, so. Okay, let's once again go to the Alpha Pal. And what are the next two gonna give me? Flame organ and leather, ice organ and pal fluid. sure that I had the correct tansy. How the hell do you think you're transporting that? Alright, 
So, logger form, logging foreman, runner. I'm not gonna have her equipped, so. It's a little cold, three minutes, that's fine. Just three more minutes and then I get my Grizz Bolt. Maybe. I have nine leather from this. It's not half bad. I can't wait till they start releasing releasing updates and patches to this game. The thing is, it's only up from here, you know. All right, so the runner, or it'll be workaholic and burly body. Eh, I guess two is better than one. So, all right, you're definitely dying. Oh, it's not what I wanted. Go left or right. Yeah. They're both hitting like sequential. Surprisingly enough, it doesn't use butcher knife health to just get do all this killing, you know. All right, so up attack, up attack, but minus work speed. Increased player defense. I mean, to be honest, all of them are garbage, but player defense goes up as pretty good, nice, so stick with that one. Oh, yeah, I can do this. Get in my cannon! Fire! Oh, and he's just dead. It's hilarious. Alright, so I'll get rid of this Pen King and this Pen King because I have one Pen King here and I have the boss that I bring around, so I'll just leave that as it is. 
Uh, I already have a Jolt Hog at base, which has insulated body. And then this one is minus attack, so let's get rid of this Jolt Hog. Alright, we'll kill these guys and then I think our egg is done. Ten cement. Yeah, but cement isn't even worth, to be honest. At least not at the point I am at right now. Although making the cold metal resistant armor, the cold resist metal armor, that might not be half bad, because if my hot one breaks, then I can just put on this one. Wait, there's gotta be something dumb in here. It's probably the leaves. Oh no, it's the PAL sphere. And actually the leaves I can probably put in another thing. Actually, you know what? It's actually a great spot to put the PAL spheres. I'll take half, cause why not? All right, now I want to make I mean, I guess I could just make the better version. Butchering for now. Ray How? Rayhound at full speed it could be mistaken for a bolt of lightning. If two Rayhounds collide, the sound is that is like that of a powerful thunderclap. Can be ridden, can double jump while mounted. Generate electricity too. Oh well I know what you're doing in my base. Oh, the Rayhound got added to my thing.
there's just certain bags of shit just flying in the sky. Alright, let me get... Let me get all my people back. Pal deck number. Um, I was rocking a lot of people towards the end, so... Petalia. I had a boss Bushi. Van Worm, I had the best one. Increases my player speed. But this one increases player defense, so... Uh, Lunaris I had, and then there was one other one, who was it? Oh yes, it was the, I know who it is, it's the boss, Pen King. Let's put the bosses up top, my flying, and then my kind of all around Lunaris.